Okay. Um, so here is a request from Mina, and then um, this is actually work. Can we can make it work? So uh, let me show you in this video how to set up a Airweaver, and let's see. If this is the case, because he has two locations, so he's supposed to have two funnel, right? Two funnel, like seven for seven, and uh, Matlan, two. So both of them, he has two funnel. So those two funnel can link to different Airweaver lists. Now let's go to the Airweaver list first. manage list and he has supposed to have and if that's the case we need to create two different Airweaver lists for different locations but you don't really need to do that one by one we can actually copy we should be able to copy one so according to Mina information the lease he wants to use is seven days and let's double confirm in his click funnel And we're supposed to link it here. Oops, you don't you didn't link it yet. Hmm. Right, okay, so here we need to link the SMTP first, right? And then that's what that's how we can use Airweaver, uh, integrate Airweaver and uh, get Airweaver notification, right? Now let's see. Integrate. Before we do that, let's do one more thing. Manage list, and you said it's seven days, right? I hope I hope we didn't. I hope we didn't. I hope me not. Didn't give me any wrong not, uh, wrong information. Okay, so this is a setting, and let's current list. So let's go to the signed up form and lead form edit. First name, email, phone number. So we make sure that the the pop up first name, email, phone number. So this is a full name. This is the email and phone number. They are not matched, so you cannot. So when you when you even after you you integrate them, it will not work, and you will you will see that the the contacts is not connected into. So what we need to do is let me check one more thing. Here, because we want the whole funnel to be fully uh, connected, so the landing page is full name, and then let's see the sales page or what we call the application page. If it's asking for, let's go to next. So let's go to the order. Um. Normally it will ask for name, first name. So here it's asking for the first name so we can change the name question in the landing page. Let's, let's do that here. You know why I changed that? Because normally if one person sign up in the first page, they've never been this page before, the whole funnel before. They sign up from the landing page and then they go to the next page. If the next page is asking for the same questions, and then the click funnel will help you auto refill the thing that he he filled out in the first page. You know, so it's it's actually better. Change that to first name. Enter your first name. And we need to make them all required. Required. Okay, and save. 
and then, then, then now what? Now we can do the integration now. Late place, right? And choose the seven day. Okay, we call it seven day, so we can save it. And let's go out. Remember, because you have a split testing page, you need to also integrate the, the second uh, page. And then here, we need to change that to the first name as well. And save and integrate. Okay, so let's go out. So I'm done with the setting, and then so now we actually change this seven days to uh. Lake, this place, right? So we we need to rename the list. Okay. Um, And then save it. And then what we need to do is the uh, the basic info here. Unique list of code for name. Notification. New subscriber is added to the list here. And then Let's check the uh, email latency, follow-up email latency. So he has no follow-up latency. Hmm. Okay, if that's the case, no problem. Let's check this one. He has he's using this one so we don't we can't touch it but I think I already changed it. It's supposed to show save saving. I didn't I didn't save it. I hope I did. Okay, now I save it and then let's create another list. Second place, that one.
we can copy the information here. I just create it first and then I can go back to go back to that other place and then manage the list, open a new link, open a new see here, open this one, new tab, open this one, and paste the, his settings. Save, personalize, and make sure everything is the same. I don't think you change anything here though. Nothing. Confirmation email. Make sure disable off. Yes. And here. Please click that you will receive the email for seven from seven. Oh come on. Days. Save this setting, and now we're done with the netland. And we need to do one more thing: is create a sign up form, and it will be exactly the same as this one. Netland, no. Nope. First name, email, phone number. Full name, but change it to okay. Let me go back. First name, email, phone number, okay, save, go to step two, no need to, change, address, don't touch that, and nothing else. Basically, we are we created. We can change the name though. And now we can go to the mat one. Edit the page. Connect the integration. OK. 
and it's not showing up yet. And let's refresh and go inside. Refresh the list from API. Because we changed the name, remember, we need to go back to the lake area and then do that again. You really have that much things to update. <laughs> There is no time. Mm. If it's not showing up, then we need to hmm. Still not updating yet. Can't believe it's so slow. Normally it's just five seconds. I don't understand why it takes so long. And um, home. We already have those things updated. No follow up email actually in his list, but we don't create emails unless they pay for the content strategies to create emails for them. So, never mind, let's go to his Zapier and see what's his Zapier account about if he is using any. I hope he's having a paid Zapier. Good, good. He's having a professional plan. So, in the case that the that the, 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 the integration don't work, just for example, the integration oh, it works. See, it's still not showing up for me. I don't understand. I don't understand. Okay, now it's showing up. Uh, we need to choose seven day met one save and 
In the meantime, don't forget first name. Here we need to change that first name. Let's test it out because I'm not sure if it's working or not. Hey, I'm not sure if it's working or not. So if it's not working, and Zapier will be our backup plan. Because you know Zapier can do anything. Every time we change the form, we need to redo the integration. Remove. Okay, now we set up the settings and how we can, how we gonna, because one of the requirement from the client is he want to know if it's from Matlan or uh, Lake area, right? So let's do this. This is a Matlan and then we delete this and we try this send the email. I, I forget I actually forgot the email. So save. And sign up form. And we already connected. Let's do preview. Let's run a test. Okay, it went through to the next page and then let's go back here and go to the home and see if it went through to the Matlan. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Submission one. Subscriber. Show me, show, yes. So I'm here. and then have the information and I suppose I am supposed to receive the notification email and let's see what the notification email looks like It will take some time here. At to least signed up to at least seven days. So now the, the the notification will show that the, what which at least that they signed up. So perfect. We don't need to change anything. We don't need to use that peer now. If we won't show, we can use that peer. But now it's actually um, already fixed the problem. So uh, one more thing I don't want to, I want to do this one more thing is to, I know that I can help you to, because we least, we link the before, we link this one before, right? 
but to another, to a uh, different page, no, at least, before we change the name. So what we need to do is remove integration and redo the integration. Save. Go and then remove integration. Reconnect. Save. Now let's do a test. Here, I went through. So, make sure go to the least setting. Make sure it goes to atoms, and in another one, we need to change that back. Mat length. Change it back. Delete. Save. So it's done. Let me do one more thing. Just make sure that Adam's email address is Adam, but this admins something else. 